Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for June the 26th of 2020, well, it is titled Eclipse Under the Bamboo. So what do we see here? Well, this is an image, or actually very many images, of the solar eclipse of June the 21st. So, the, this was what we called an annular solar eclipse, because if you were on the right location, at maximum, the moon was blocking out the sun, and in fact, directly in front of the sun, but was not quite large enough to block out the entire sun, leaving a ring or annulus around the surface of the moon. So the moon would block out most of the sun, but there would be a complete ring around it. Now that occurred if you were in just the right location. If you were a little further off that, that eclipse path, then you would see a partial eclipse, which is what we see here. At this point, about 60% of the sun being blocked. Now, why do we see so many images? Well, we're looking at it through the bamboo trees, and you can see them out in the foreground here, and the leaves up above make essentially a whole bunch of pinhole cameras. A very simple camera, a pinhole, and then that will allow the light to focus on the ground. So you can make a very simple camera like this with a piece of cardboard by poking a pinhole in it and then projecting that onto another piece of cardboard. And that is a way to safely be able to view the eclipse. Viewing an eclipse itself, seeing the eclipse is not dangerous. It's looking at the sun is what can damage your eyes. Now normally when we look at the sun, we instinctively look away because it is so bright. However, when a significant portion of the sun's surface is covered, it is not quite so painful to look at, but that little bit of the surface still visible is incredibly damaging and can burn the image into your retina. So that's why this is one of the ways to be able to observe the eclipse without damaging your eye at all. So here you could see all of these images, and if you watch them over time, you would be able to watch the eclipse go, go through all of its phases from start, when just a tiny portion of the sunlight is blocked by the moon, to the maximum eclipse, about what we see here, and then as the moon begins to move away from the sun again, and more and more of the sun becomes visible. So here is a very safe and easy way to be able to view an eclipse. All you need is a, a region of a tr under a tree with significant leaf cover and just a few small pinholes coming through as gaps between the leaves to be able to watch this eclipse. And as I mentioned, you can actually make something like this yourself, at least for a single image, with a couple of pieces of cardboard. And again, another way to be able to view the sun in safety and not have to stare at the sun, which can cause significant damage to your eyes. So here we get to see, again, many, many images of the solar eclipse of June the 21st. So that was our picture of the day for June the 26th of 2020. It was titled Eclipse Under the Bamboo. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.